Summer is not over, and we are celebrating our neighborhoods, and we are supporting our number one sport in Chicago right now, which is basketball. It started in Pilsen with the Resurrection Project. They thought it was an idea that they could calm some corners with some hot activity. And so they decided, well, if we stand on the corners and do something, then that activity will go away. And so they put up basketball hoops and started playing. And then we heard about it at LISC, and we work across the city and neighborhoods, and all of our partners wanted to get in. This is my first like annual Hoops in the Hood, but I've, I've been hearing about it. It was at the gym that I was at. I heard about it. It was a good program to keep us off the streets and at least doing our activity. Today behind me, you're going to see kids playing each other from all over the, uh, the city, all over different neighborhoods. And it really, it's, um, it gives kids an opportunity to experience other, especially teens, other teens from other areas of the city and understand, hey, you're, you, uh, he or she, you're just like me. I just think it's kind of really valued because there's just a place that you can go out and play and be yourself. It breaks down the what I consider to be the superficial barriers, the territorial boundaries, and the, diff, the, the divide between the neighborhood. It brings uh, youth together to play in a fun, safe environment, and they get the opportunity to get to know each other, meet new friends, and you know, just to practice camaraderie and good sportsmanship. Hoops in the Hood is showing that we are a family of one, no matter what area we live in. Come together, play together, have fun, and get to enjoy each other out of their own circle. For us, it was important to send a message that all neighborhoods are part of Chicago. If you give our young people the opportunity to really do something positive, especially give them a basketball opportunity, they come. You know, and so I think it's very important, especially, um, unfortunately, you know, we hear a lot about the crime situation. In